Welcome to the Solid Edge with Synchronous Technology 3D to 2D test drive. In this test drive, we're going to provide step by step instructions for creating a, a detailed drawing of a micrometer component using Solid Edge with Synchronous Technology. We're going to cover the drawing creation technique, such as defining the size of the drawing sheet and view orientation standards. Placing common views, such as principal, section, and detail views, is also going to be covered. We'll also show you how to retrieve dimensions from 3D part models and place dimensions manually. Lastly, we're going to edit the source part and update the revised drawing. Now, Solid Edge provides quick sheet capabilities for fast drawing productions and ensures that your engineers adhere to the same standards. Solid Edge also gives you ultimate control of how the drawing is going to look according to the standards you choose. Solid Edge with uh, synchronous technology supports a wide range of drawing standards such as ANSI, ISO, DIN, JIS, and etc. This makes it easy to configure your Solid Edge installation so it meets the standards to which your drawings must conform. What we want to do to begin this uh, step one graphically is to come over to the application button and go to the sheet setup. And what we want to do here is just show you where you can change this, uh, the uh, sheet setup by maybe changing the standard. Now in this case we do want the A2 uh, wide and that's what we're looking at but you see all the other standards that we support. You can also change the name of the sheet. In this case it's called sheet one and of course we do want the background to be on. We also can come back to the application button and we are going to come down to the solid edge options and on there you're going to find drawing standards. For drawing standards, in this case we're going to go ahead and use ANSI. We're going to go to third angle projection and uh, I think everything else is, uh, is OK. So we'll go ahead and click on the OK button. Now this basically sets up step one and allows us to continue on to step two. So make sure that your, uh, uh, your students are up to this point and have these standards set.